Super 3000 minus 2 minimum order quantity 1 product description power unit Super 3000 minus 2. Engine 6 cylinder diesel engine, liquid cooled manufacturer Dutes type TCD 2015 V64 volts nominal 300 kilowatts, 1800 revolutions per minute eco mode 292 kilowatts, 1500 revolutions per minute fuel tank 600 liters undercarriage crawler tracks provided with rubber pads ground contact 3300 millimeters by 400 meters suspension rigid track tension adjuster elastomer track rollers lifetime grease lubricated traction drive separate hydraulic drive and electronic control provided for each crawler track speeds pave up to 24 meters per minute travel up to 4.5 kilometers per hour power steering by alteration of track running speed service brake high hydraulic parking brake spring loaded multiple disc brake maintenance free the super 3000 minus 2 as the flagship of the vogel fleet of pavers makes itself well paid on projects where high pavement quality is required together with a high laydown rate this large paver is capable of handling any type of road construction material whether gravel lean mixed concrete or asphalt the Super 3000-2 builds pavements true to line and level, with perfect surface accuracy and high density. Nautilus Minerals The world's first ever deep-sea mineral extraction machines. These three remotely controlled mineral extraction machines, the largest of which is 300T were designed to extract massive sulfides in the Bismarck Sea off Papua New Guinea. The mineral deposit has an average depth of 1,600 meters below mean sea level and they were produced back in 2016 for Nautilus Minerals Inc. an early pioneer in deep sea mineral exploration and extraction. Each of these vehicles is controlled from the ship's control room via an umbilical. This supplies power to multiple copper cores, as well as communications, data and control commands via fiber optic cables, which are all wrapped in an armored casing. The three machines. A-U-X-I-L-L-I-A-R-Y cutter. The first machine used as part of the extraction is the auxiliary cutter, which creates a level working surface for the subsequent bulk cutter and collector machines. Bulk cutter. The bulk cutter is the main production machine and the heaviest deep sea mineral extraction unit ever built, weighing in at over a colossal 300 tons. Designing a ship-based launch and recovery system was challenging for something of this size so we settled on a cantilever system. The installed power of the cutter head is also bigger than any other rock cutter at 1.2 megawatts. The power is supplied via an umbilical from the vessel. Collecting machine. In the planned extraction technique, the giant bulk cutter grinds up the seafloor with each pass, before the collector sucks up material from the piles made by the bulk cutter, which is then transferred via a riser pipe to the production support vessel on the surface where it is dewatered. DONSSE Scorpion has undeniably set new standards in our forests, especially in terms of productivity and ergonomics. And not just for us, as the many scorpion harvesters from PONSSE impressively show in use around the world. Thanks to its unique design, the Scorpion offers the driver incomparable clarity for all work. The completely new frame construction consists of three segments connected to one another by robust swivel joints. The front and rear segment with the bogey axes can adapt to the ground independently of the middle segment with the cabin. The resulting movements are effectively compensated for by hydraulic cylinders, which enables the driver to work very comfortably and ergonomically. The proven eight-wheel chassis and the low center of gravity achieve extremely high stability when working. There is also an actively controlled stabilization system. This patented system controls the stabilizing cylinders on the rear frame depending on the crane and load situation. The PONSSE Scorpion is either with a 210cc working pump or a Scorpion King with a two-circuit hydraulic system with a 145cc crane and a 190cc. Terex HRX 5560FT tracked overcenter material handling bucket bucket specifications. Working height, 60FT, basket on, curbside, of upper boom 116 degrees of lower boom articulation. Fiberglass upper boom, 193 degrees of articulation. Fiberglass lower boom insert minus 18 inches clear. Category C machine rated at 46 kilo volts 24 inches by 48 inches basket, 700 pounds. Capacity 24 inches by 48 inches basket liner, vinyl basket and control cover, 
Hydraulic basket rotator. Single stick upper controls. Hydraulic basket tilt, with control at basket 2000 LB. Hydraulic articulating jib and winch 115 degrees of articulation and 6 fourth of extension. Hydraulic jib extension underload. Jib and winch mounted on street side of upper boom. Dual hydraulic tool outlet at basket controls. Automatic throttle control. Rossin TV-1000 is a high-capacity self-propelled snowblower especially designed for snow-clearing operations at airports The snowblower is a key product in the newly developed performance line series by Over Osic with features such as an aerodynamic design new environmentally friendly engines and with a sophisticated digital system both inside the vehicles and as part of several advanced fleet management systems the TV-1000 is designed to handle snow depths up to 2 meters and has a casting capacity of up to 45 meters with the total power of 1300 horsepower the snowblower will keep the same speed as the rest of the fleet during snow clearing operations the tv1000 offers great mobility with its four wheel drive and steering the four wheel steering guarantees optimal utilization of the snowblower to meet the capacity requirements at larger airports over Assen also offers the tv1000 plus version with a 30% increase in capacity a snowblower which will be able to clear up to 9,000 metric tons of snow per hour the TV-1000 comes with a unique flying cap the ability to move the cabin from standard rear position to the front of the machine gives the operator an optimal view during the worst possible weather conditions the movable cabin increases the operator's viewing angle in front of and to the sides of the snowblower making it safer for the operator and its surroundings the flying cab also greatly reduces vibration and noise levels in the cabin adding to the operator's comfort the sound level on the cabin is only 74 dba under full load as part of the performance line's digital platform tv 1000 can be fitted with the latest over ross and fleet management technology Asin has introduced the Fleet Cloud a two-way communication system for real-time surveillance collecting of operating data service messages and fault reports the engine room of the TV-1000 has been designed for easy and spacious access of all important service points every service point is equipped with a unique QR code for online information and service routines, Asin. LB44-510, presented for the first time at BAMA 2013, is the latest development from the Lieber Foundation Engineering product area and extends the tried and tested LB series of large rotary drilling rigs at the top end. The LB44-510 with a torque of 510 km is the largest and most powerful large rotary drilling rig currently in use in Germany. In the Kelly drill insert, it is designed for drilling diameters of up to 3 meters and drilling depths of a maximum of 92 meters. The approximately 170T heavy special foundation engineering device is moved by a V8 diesel engine with 505 kilowatts, 687 horsepower, drive power, which complies with the emission standard according to emission stage IIIB, here for us. Despite its considerable size, the large rotary drilling rig LB44-510, which weighs 170T, requires very little time for its mobilization and commissioning. Since the leader and the connected hydraulics can be folded up during transport, no dismantling is required between two locations. 
the LB44-510 can then be set up quickly using a quick assembly system. This process hardly takes any more time than with smaller devices. Another advantage is the easy portability of the device. If necessary, it can be dismantled so that the weight of the heaviest unit does not exceed 40 p. This means that it can be transported around the world without any major problem.